Hi, I'm Kara Dottori, pharmacy student at the University of Connecticut School of Pharmacy, working in conjunction with Dr. Diana Soberai, associate professor at the School of Pharmacy. I'm here to discuss the V-Safe after vaccination health checker developed by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. This is part of a series on the Pfizer and Moderna COVID-19 vaccines, and we hope you find it informative. We are providing this general information based on our assessment of the COVID-19 vaccine literature, and it was current at the time of recording. This is not a substitute for medical advice provided by your personal healthcare provider. If you have a medical emergency, please call 911 right away. We have received no funding from Pfizer, Moderna, or any other group. We just want to help you make an informed decision. After a vaccine is approved for use in the United States, there is continued monitoring for side effects as the public is vaccinated. This helps to watch for side effects that may not have been seen in the clinical trials and to assure that the benefits of vaccination continue to outweigh any risks. The CDC has several surveillance systems in place, but to gather real-time information from people who have received the COVID-19 vaccines, they develop several new tools. One is called VSafe. VSafe is a smartphone-based tool that uses text messaging and web-based surveys to quickly check in with you after getting a COVID-19 vaccine. The check-ins ask you how you are feeling daily for the first week and then weekly for up to five weeks and take less than five minutes to complete. There's also a check-in after the second vaccine dose and at three, six, and 12 months after your final dose. You can report side effects after getting the COVID-19 vaccine through VSAFE, as well as this may prompt someone from the CDC calling to check in on you and get more information about the event. Finally, VSAFE will remind you when it is time for your second vaccine dose. To enroll in VSAFE, you can visit vsafe.cdc.gov. You may also receive a flyer at the time you are vaccinated with instructions on how to enroll. Although enrollment is voluntary, public participation is critical in providing real-time information about the safety monitoring for the COVID-19 vaccines. The more people that participate, the more information there is available for the scientists and experts at the CDC to evaluate to assure continued public safety as the vaccine distribution continues.